It's unfortunate that sometimes there are four types of Christians in God's church according to their specialization. What do I mean? There are Christians that specialize in division. If we're talking about the four fundamentals, there are Christians who seem to specialize in division. These are the ones who are into gossip and slander and accusations without basis. They refuse to forgive. They refuse to reconcile. And so they are specialists in division. And the outside world and Satan himself is laughing. They're laughing and saying, look at what these Christians are doing. And that's why Jesus prayed, Oh, Father, I pray that they may be one. And that's why he said, love one another as I have loved you. And then there are Christians who specialize in subtraction. These are those Christians, I would imagine, I hope and pray, very few. But these are the ones whose personal lifestyle poses no contrast to the rest of the world. There's no difference. The daily behavior, the choices, the priorities are just like the rest of the world. No light, no salt, no contrast. And so rather than attracting people to Jesus, people just go their own merry way, they fall away, and they find Christianity unattractive. And then there are Christians who specialize in addition. Well, this is wonderful. They bring people to church. They bring people to a small group. That's wonderful. But the missing piece is this. They don't take responsibility for discipling that person. And that's why Jesus is looking for those who specialize in multiplication. Because this is what every Christian should be doing when Jesus says, go and make disciples. That is the application, folks. If we're going to say, like Isaiah said, here, I am, here am I, send me, this is the best application there is.